Hi friends, welcome to JSM Maths Academy. Today we are going to discuss about the division of any number by 99. Let us start with the first example. That is 2403 divided by 9. In the Vedic Maths, we will consider the powers of a 10 as a base. Here our divisor is 99, it's nearest to the 100. So we consider base is 100. If base is 100, then divisor is 99. The difference between the divisor and the base is 1. This is known as a nikhilam in Vedic mass. Now, now we are going to use the nikhilam method of division. In this, this nikhilam plays an important role. If base is 100, nikhilam should be written in two digits. Here, difference between 99 and, and 100 is 1. That can be written as a single digit. But, as our base is 100, in our base, two digits are, two zeros are there. So, our nikhilam also should be in a two digits, as in zero one. So, let us go, for, go with the division process. Before going to do the division process, firstly, we have to adjust this um, dividend and divisor in this manner. And we have to write down the nikhilam of the, our divisor. What is the nikhilam of our divisor? That is zero one. Then we have to separate our dividend into two parts by taking a line after the two digits from the right. That means after the tens place we have to take a straight line. Then this straight line divides our dividend into two parts. In that first part is known as the quotient part. This is quotient part and this is a remainder part. Now let us start with the division. So firstly we have to Take down the leftmost digit that is 2 as easy. Then this 2 and product of nikhilam. Product of nikhilam. 2 into 0 1 is 0 2. In 2 digits we have to write. Then add this 4. Then 4 into 0 1 that is 0 4. Write down in the next places and add them. So 2 and 7. So by this you get a quotient as a 24 and the remainder is 27. Let us see the second problem. That is of 1729 divided by 99. Firstly, let us uh, adjust these uh, numbers in this manner. Then we have to write down the nikhilam of 99. That is 0, 01. Then we have to divide this our dividend into two parts by taking straight line after the tens plus. Then bring down the leftmost digit. That is 1 and take the product of 1 and this nikhilam that is 0 1 again and add 7 then take the product of 7 and 0 1 that is 0 7 add them this is 3 and, and adding this you get 16 here this 16 is a 2 digit number in this 1's place digit will take as a, as 16 and 10's place digit should be carried out to the next part so that you get 46 3 plus 1 is 4 and portion of part is same. So, here on dividing 1729, we get a quotient as an 17 and the remainder is 46. Let us see the next question. 1235 divided by 99. Firstly, we have to arrange the dividend and divide divisors in this manner and write down the nikhilam that is 0 1 and separate the div dividend by taking a straight line after the tens place then write down the leftmost digit as one as easily one into product of nikhilam one and nikhilam that is zero one then add them it is two then again uh, multiply that is you get a zero two so that uh, and adding this you get a 47 by this you get a quotient is 12 remainder is 47 just uh, addition itself this is third problem now we are going to discuss about fourth problem 6174 divided by 99. We have to arrange the dividend and divisors in this manner. Then nikhilam of 99, 0, 1, and separate our divisor, so separate our dividend by taking a straight line. Then take down the first uh, digit is 6, 6 into nikhilam, 0, 6, add this 1, then again 1 into 0, 1, this 0, 1, and adding this, we get to 5 and 13. Here, you get quotient is uh, 61 and remainder is 135. But if you observe this, our remainder is 135 is um, more than the divisor. Whenever you get a remainder is more than our divisor, 
then we have to add one to the quotient and subtract the divisor from the remainder part. So that you and adding one to the quotient part, you get a 62 is a quotient, and and subtracting 99 from this, you get a 36 is a remainder. By this, you get a quotient is 62, and remainder is 36. Let us see the next problem. 21,043 divided by 99. Firstly, let us arrange this uh, dividend and divisors in this uh, manner. Then take down the nucleum of 99, that is 0, 01. Then separate the dividend by taking a straight line after 2 digits. Then write down the first digit is 2, 2 into 0, 01, that is 0, 02. Add this, you get a 1. And 1 into 0, 01, 0, 01. And add this, 2. Then again 1 into our nucleum, that is 2 into our nucleum, that is 0 to. And adding this, you get a 55. You get a 55 the remainder. In this, you get a quotient. Quotient we got as a 212. Remainder is, remainder is 55. Remainder is 55. That is the sixth problem. Sixth problem, 34,125 divided by 99. So, let us arrange this dividend and divisor. Now, take down the nucleum of 499, 01, and separate our divisor by taking a straight line after the ones, after the tens place. Now, write down the first place digit, that is 3. 3 into nucleum is 03. And adding this, you get 4. 4 into nucleum is 04. And adding this, you get 4. Now, 4 into nucleum, that is 04. You get, and adding this one, you get 69. By this, you get a quotient is 344 and remainder is 69. Let us see the next problem. That is of 12,345 divided by 99. 12,345 divided by 99. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. By 99. I am separating our dividend by taking a straight line after the tens place. Then I am writing nucleum as 0 01. Then bring down the leftmost digit that is 1. 1 into nucleum is 0 01. And adding this, you get a 2. 2 into nucleum is 0 02. Then and adding this, you get 4. Then 4 into nucleum is 0 04. And adding this all, you get a 69. You get a 69. Then from this, you get a quotient is 124 and remainder is 69. Remainder is 69. Let us see the last problem of this video. That is of 41,675 divided by 99. So, firstly, let us arrange the dividend and divisor in this manner. Then write down the nucleum. Then separate the dividend by taking a straight line after the tens plus. Then bring down the first uh, the leftmost digit that is 4. 4 into nucleum is 0, 4. And adding this, you get 1. 1 into nucleum is 0, 1. Then add, adding this, you get a 10. Here, you must be careful. You got a 2 digit number in the quotient part here itself. So, in this, 1's plus digit is so we have to write here. And 10's plus digit, you should write down to the, down to the previous digit. Then, and, uh, you get a 10. This 10 into nucleum is 0, 10. Or else you can write it as a 1 0, no problem here. Then an adding is you get a 9, 8 and 15. Here in quotient part uh, and remainder part also we got a 2 digit number. In this 2 digit number, this tens plus digit you should write to the write down to the previous digit and add that. By this you get a 420 and 95. So that you get a quotient is 420 and the remainder is 95. Here you, could, you should understand that whenever you get a uh, two digits and adding in this process, in that one's place digit should be taken, uh, taken in that particular place and tens place digit should be carried out to the previous digit. So that you get an accurate answer. So thank you friends sir, for watching this video.